Hi, welcome back to Shotoku Tech. I'm working on the sequel to my previous video. This one's called Migrating Azure AD from ADFS to Password Hash Sync. As part of the procedure, I need to install MS Online module in PowerShell. But I cannot install NuGet in PowerShell. So I can't install MS Online. Well, now what to do? Look for the information in the description down below. Yeah, you see all the errors piling up here. Basically, can't get new Git, can't get MS Online. So, let's see the security protocols in use for PowerShell by running this command. Net Service Point Manager Security Protocol. Ah, there you see SSL3 and TLS. These are deprecated at this point. We need more juice. Let's run these two PowerShell commands that tell .NET Framework to use strong cryptography. These put in dword values in the registry for the .NET Framework. Close PowerShell and reopen it. Now let's run that .NET Service Point Manager Security Protocol command again and see TLS 1.2 is an available security protocol. Let's run install module PowerShell get with the force parameter. This looks promising. You can see there's a lot of download activity going on and it's trying to install it. Ah, darn if there is not another error. We need the skip publisher check parameter to get the job done. There we go. Now we can install the MS Online module and get back to making that migrating Azure AD from ADFS to password hash sync video. Stay tuned. Before you go on to watch these videos, please check the links in the description down below. Like and comment on this video. Also, please click on subscribe to help me keep making these videos. Thank you very much.